in today's presentation i will tell you some key points about scabies scabies is a contagious skin infection caused by the infestation of a tiny mite called sarcopede scabiae it is characterized by a rash on the skin associated with severe itching scabies spreads through close personal contact such as holding hands sexual activity or sharing bedding or clothing with an infected person here are some key points about scabies the most common symptom of scabies is severe itching especially at night the itching is usually accompanied by a rash which consists of a small red bumps or blisters the rash can appear on various parts of the body including the wrists elbows armpits waist genital area and between the fingers Scabies is primarily transmitted through direct prolonged skin to skin contact with an infected person. It can also spread indirectly through infested items such as bedding, clothing or furniture. Scabies mites can survive for a few days away from the human body. These are some commonly involved sites of rashes of scabies. A healthcare professional can diagnose scabies by examining the affected areas of the skin and looking for characteristic signs such as burrows or tiny red lines. In some cases, they may perform a skin scraping and examine it under a microscope to confirm the presence of scabies mites. Scabies can be effectively treated with prescription medications. The most common treatment is a topical cream or lotion that is applied to the entire body from the neck down. Permethrin and ivermectin are commonly prescribed medications for scabies. It's important to follow the instructions provided by the healthcare professional and complete the full course of treatment. To prevent the spread of scabies, it's important to avoid close physical contact with infected individuals and to wash or dry clean infested clothing, bedding and towels. Household members and sexual partners of an infected person should also be treated even if they do not show symptoms. The itching associated with scabies can persist for several weeks even after successful treatment. Your healthcare professional may recommend over-the-counter antihistamines or topical corticosteroids to relieve the itching. Thank you for listening. If you want to learn more medical stuff and common clinical conditions, subscribe the channel so you will be notified whenever a new topic is covered. If you like the video, make sure to drop a like. Let me know if you have any suggestions in the comments below.